my loves, welcome back to another episode of Indulge with Sophie. And today we're going to be making parfaits, healthy parfaits, okay? Not the drive through kind. All right, so you have your option of either doing an unsweetened Greek yogurt or you can have the vanilla flavor. They were buy one, get one free, so honey, I got them both. And then we're going to have some granola. I got some gluten-free because I need it. We've got honey to sweeten or maple syrup and then an assortment of nuts to sprinkle on top along with our beautiful plate of berries. We've got strawberries, blueberries, and raspberries. Okay, so first we're going to start with our yogurts. Now what's really nice about this, this is something you can either plate the night before if you are late procrastinator like me and always on the go you can have it ready made sitting in the fridge and have your granola set aside to sprinkle on top however we're going to make it fresh today also with the yogurt you get a nice punch of protein but to add sweetness to the unsweetened greek yogurt you can sprinkle a little of your protein powder so you'll have an additional amount of protein added to it and i actually when i was heavily in the gym it, this was a really nice healthy treat so give yourself a good amount of the yogurt i love greek yogurt some people don't like the texture but i prefer the creaminess i don't know i just like the way it feels in my mouth so here we go here's a good amount of yogurt next we are going to get our berries so like i said we're getting a nice punch of protein with our greek yogurt and if you want to add your protein powder you can and with our berries we're getting some vitamins some antioxidants from the berries and that sweetness also i do believe the berries are keto friendly so if you're keto berries are good to go to so I'm just going to give it a nice little sprinkle all over. I don't know about you, but I cannot eat mushy blueberries. Like they have to have that nice firmness, like a nice youthful blueberry. Cause if it's mushy, I'm just a texture person. I really just can't. So next we're going to add our granola. They have different kinds at the grocery store. I went with this gluten-free one. It has vanilla, almond, and agave. But choose what you like. If you want something that has chocolate chips, you can. We did. So I'm going to sprinkle some of this on top. So you get the smooth creaminess of the Greek yogurt. You get the nice bite and pop of the fresh, juicy berries. You get a nice crisp crunch with the granola. And then we're going to add our natural sweetness using either the honey or the maple syrup. Oh, but wait, I forgot to add. We're gonna add a few nuts. I grabbed this uh, assortment of nuts. It's got uh, peanuts, almonds, pistachios, pecans, walnuts. It also has pumpkin seeds. And I didn't know that pumpkin seeds are actually help get rid of parasites. So it's always good to eat like a handful of pumpkin seeds um, every day. Sprinkle that on top. I prefer honey. Um, if you can, go to your local farm um, and get some local honey, especially if you have allergies. Since those bees are getting the pollen from the local flowers it's said to help with your allergies so doing like a teaspoon or so of that honey every day will help you we drizzle our honey on top nice and beautifully and voila we have got our healthy nutritious parfait made so quickly so easily and it's beautiful you can also give this to your kiddos you can even freeze the yogurt 
and turn it into an ice cream with berries. So you have so many options here. So delicious. Let's get a bite. Whoa! I think I want a bit of raspberry and a bit of strawberry. So I've got a nice little bite here. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I always get a little nervous using the unsweetened Greek yogurt. However, when you drizzle that honey on top, it is the perfect amount of sweetness and it's guilt free at the same time. So good, so delicious. Let me know what you think when you make this yourself. Like, comment, and subscribe. And also, as always, let me know what things you'd like to see me make. And again, thank you for joining me with Indulge with Sophie. And I can't wait to see you next time.